brothers Eugenio and Fernando Lopez, cousins of Victoria Lopez de Araneta, and Don Salvador C. Araneta, created the Iloilo Negros Air Express Company, or INAEC. By 1937, INAEC acquired the 16-seater Sikorsky, the same airplane being used then by the Pan American Airways in the United States. When World War II broke out, the INAEC flipped in Iloilo is completely destroyed, but the entrepreneurial spirits of its founders lingered on and company bounced back, this time remaining the company as Far Eastern Air Transport Incorporated, or FIAT. In June 6, 1946, Don Salvador C. Araneta became its first president. In 1947, Fiatitech made history when it launched its first Philippine-made glider. Later, Dr. Victoria Lopez de Araneta became the second president of Fiatitech after his husband, Don Salvador Z. Araneta. This time, many graduates of Yati Tech became commissioned officer in the Philippine Air Force, a confirmation of its excellent education program. The Fiati Vice President Dr. Gregorio Y. Zara invented the alcohol-based aircraft engine, another first in the schools of history. 1959, Fiati again made history when it opens its own television station and became Fiati University. By 1961, Fiati launched General Marex, a locally made robot that can talk, move, and obey simple commands. Fiati reached the 45,000 in volleys in just one school year. By the 1980s, Fiati faced many challenges, but when Jose Segovia won in as its third president, Fiati University completely evolved to a better school. By 1990s, Fiati graduates is one of the top board passers. By the term of new millennium, Fiati University continued to create solid milestones. 